footage to Timmy's here for any fans of the um, Hulu series Shogun, which I thought was good. Uh, that was probably like one of the best shows of the year. I don't think it's that. F I'm not going to go that far, but it was a pretty cool show. And all. But looks like uh, Shogun is now uh, being looked at. You get picked up for not two, but th uh, for pretty much about two more seasons. This comes from Deadline Sting. Uh, that just a just a week after it was reported that Hayao Sonata, ha Harupi Sonata, I can never pronounce the name too well, but he's a good, he's a cool actor by the way, uh, would return for another Shogun season. FX and Hulu announced that they are developing two new seasons of their claim drama. In an official announcement through the Hulu part, FX revealed that it would uh, be teaming up with the estate of author jo James Cle uh, Clavel who wrote the original uh, Shogun's novel in 1975 to extend the story of ch about two additional seasons. Season 2 and 3 are both currently in development, and writer's rooms are being assembled. assembled. Shogun Season 1's creative team included uh, co-creators, co exec producers, and writers Justin Marks and Rachel Kondo, who are set to return and be involved uh, with the development. It's reported that Sonata, who played Lord Yo Yoshi uh, Toronaga, uh, would also be returning for the series. It's unclear exactly uh, what uh, what uh, the second season will be about um, as of now, as the first season uh, covered the contents of the book that um, it was based on, ending similarly to the uh, where the 1975 James Calvell novel did. To be honest, I never read the novel, so I can't really comment if it's as good as the novel. I'm not much of a book reader. Don't don't judge me. Uh, so yeah, I mean, of course, if you guys don't know, uh, at first the Emmy, um, it was gonna be uh submitted for a limited series at the Emmys, but now it looks like it's gonna be submitted into the drama series, which I, it could easily sweep. I mean, again, I'm not I'm not too huge with the series as as I should be. I I, th I just thought it was okay. Maybe if I'm more familiar with the books, I would have enjoyed it more. But it was visually stunning. Uh, the cast was pretty good. Anna Sawa, who of course was in, um, I, I actually think she was better in uh, the Godzilla show, but she's still pretty good in this. Uh, you know, she she was pretty solid. Uh, James Co Cosmo, which lots of people uh, want him to be, uh, to be the new Wolverine. And you know what? After seeing this, I could totally see him as a new Wolverine. Uh, it also featured the, uh, detective, I can't rem remember the actor's name, uh, Nestor Corbano, he actually played the, uh, detective in Base Motel, uh, and he was great in Base Motel, it was cool seeing him in this, uh, so I'm actually interested to see where they're gonna take the next two seasons, uh, we probably won't get these two shows for quite some time, I think maybe 2026 for season two, and 2027 for season three, so, it's gonna be a long wait. Uh, but let me let you guys, Winning Doors on Shogun being looked at to get renewed for not two, but for about two more seasons. Are you even looking for to check out more Shogun? Are you even, like, are you even a fan of the series? And were you ever a fan of the Shogun books or the original, uh, miniseries in general? Drop comments below. Don't forget to like, subscribe, hit that bell for notifications. This is Simmons.